In this video, I'll hire people off Fiverr to edit one of my Shopify dropshipping product video ads, and the whole point of the challenge is to hire loads of different people from different price ranges so I can compare the service. So I'll go from $5 all up to $50, and what I wanna compare is the service of quality, the video ads that they actually make for me, and any benefits they include with the service. So I started off the challenge by going to AliExpress and searching for a suitable Shopify dropshipping product, and I found the portable blender, and it's directly from the AliExpress supplier, and it came with some really good video footage then what I did is I went to Fiverr and I sent a generic message to loads of different people on Fiverr with gigs with different price ranges and the message said hey if I share the product that I want to drop ship will you find the content and make the video ads for me then I put the link to the product and then I also say to them I need to make sure that these are the minimum requirements. It has to be between 30 and 60 seconds long and it needs to be copyright free music. Then I left everything else up to the people on Fiverr to do because I wanna see what their professionalism is when it comes to dropshipping video ads. Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. My name's Camille Sutton, known as the Ecom King and in today's video, it's just for a bit of entertainment and like I said, I'm just gonna be hiring loads of different people off Fiverr to edit one of my Shopify dropshipping product video ads and like I said, the price ranges will differ from $5 all up to $50 and let's See who is going to be the best and i'll be ranking it from number one to number five and like i said i'm going to be comparing it on service of quality what extra benefits do they give me and overall video ad production now i just want to say a massive shout out to these two youtube creators on the screen because they influenced this video because they did a video similar on their own channel which was really cool and i thought it'd be cool to do this for drop shipping I'm also going to be giving away the five video ads that you see in this video to one of you lucky subscribers. Now, all you need to do to enter the giveaway is smash the like button and comment something that you like about the channel or something that you want to see in the future on this channel. And I'll be picking a winner once we hit 5,000 likes on this video. So the first person on the list is going to be Arts Inside and she's got a gig on Fiverr saying I will create Facebook video ads for dropshipping products. She's got a 4.9 star review based on 15 and she's got four orders in the queue. And if you look at her gig, the basic package, it says start your business package for five dollars one eye-catching viral product video ad and it's going to be a three-day delivery time with three revisions and she's going to include video editing script writing 30 second running time one size orientation show product imagery and background music so it definitely fits the requirements that i was looking for for this gig and if we go down and read what the gig is all about it says Shopify video ads. Are you looking to create vi Facebook video ads to drive traffic into clicks and conversions? Well, I'm glad you found me. Your customers are more likely to buy from your online store when they see visually attractive Facebook ads rather than image ads. Professional background music, e-commerce, online advertising. I'm able to make outstanding Facebook ads for any product that will catch viewers' attention and engage their emotions. So for $5, she sounds like she's got a lot on the table. So if we take a look at her Fiverr profile, it says she's from the Philippines. She joined Fiverr back in January 2020, so she's very new to the platform her average response time is an hour and her last delivery was six hours ago and her bio says i'm a professional graphic designer video editor from the last four years and more i'm one who delivers work efficiently with 100 percent quality and you can check all my listed services on my fover profile and it says here i'm a high self-motivated driven person who's organized and is quick at learning and i can guarantee that the work i'm doing is at the top expectations so for five dollars she's worth testing and seeing how good she really Really is so you guys can see i messaged her the script that i was mentioning at the start of the video saying hey if i send you the product are you able to make a video for me and she responded by saying hello yes i can definitely create a video ad for you is this for facebook ads i put yes then she put what type of video do you want sir and then i put one with 30 to 60 second longs facebook ads for portable blender she put okay sir my starter package offers 30 seconds running time i said 30 seconds is fine and then i said please send me an offer she put okay sir but are you in a rush because my gig offers three day delivery time is that okay i put yes that's fine thanks and then she sent me the custom offer and then i've accepted it so her delivery time she said was going to be three days so guys two days later she actually sent me the video ad that she created me and she actually did it a day faster than she originally said so i give her a lot of respect for that now before i actually show the video that she made for me let me just quickly explain what makes a good video ad so you want to start the video off by doing a hook or an attention grabber then you want to show the results that the product can do then you want to demonstrate how it's done and then you want to show the usage and what i mean by usage is like the daily activity of that product or the daily usage of it or how it's used normally and then you want to finish off the video with a clear call to action so those are my five steps to a really good video so guys now let me showcase the five dollar video that was made for me but if you see me looking down it's because i'm taking notes on the ipad about what i thought of the video now i just want to make something clear when i watch the video the first time i'm not going to be really talking too much i'm just going to be 
analyzing it and taking notes but once it's finished then i'm going to go over it with you guys and explain what i thought about it what could be better then i'm going to be giving you my rating for the video There's a bit too much text on the screen, like, and with the text that she's got there, it was black and you couldn't really read it, so that's the only bad thing I can see so far. Mm. And the, the colors are a bit feminine as well. Feminine. That text there at the bottom is just really hard to read in black because there's no highlights. And I just feel like it's made for a girl. But you know what? That call to action was actually really, really cool. I really do like that call to action. Really colorful. Shows the product. Shows the fruit behind it. And then it says, get yours now. So I really do like that call to action, actually. So I'm going to put that down. So in this first opening scene, I always said to you guys, remember, the first thing you want to do is you want to do what we call a hook or an attention grab it. And if you look at the first part, you can see here, it shows somebody pouring the smoothie into the glass. And it says, prepare a healthy smoothies. And I feel like the English grammar on that is not very good. Prepare a healthy smoothie. It should be prepare a healthy smoothie, not prepare healthy smoothies. So the English grammar on that is not too good. And obviously, although it is $5, if somebody sees that, especially in the first clip, that's the first thing somebody's going to read and look at, they're going to see that uh, error and they're going to think, hmm, that's not too professional. So if she was going to make a mistake like that, I wish she did it at the end, not the start. But to be fair, again, especially with the opening clip, it wasn't really an attention grabber. And I feel like that footage there with that title doesn't really get me hooked on it. So I don't really like that too much. And I feel like the clip should have been real notoriated. It's like that clip should have been at the start and the start of the clip should have been a little bit in the mid roll. I feel like she's got the clip orientation the wrong way round. Um, and again, back with that pink text, you could see it there, that pink text, and it just looked a little bit girly and I didn't like that. Um, and then you can see this bit here. And like I said before, there's just a bit too much text at the top and at the bottom. And you can see this black text here and it's really hard to read on that background. I do like the fact that she has included um, basically showing that it's for people that are going running and stuff like that i thought that was pretty cool and i like the way she's showing the different markets that would use it instead of just one market like the fitness market i also think the clips that she used are a little bit boring i feel like she should have speed ramped the clips a little bit speed ramping just means basically speeding it up because for somebody to watch some of those clips just in normal time i think it just drags on a little bit and if she speed ramped it up a little bit and did a little bit more of the transitions it would have been a lot more smoother so overall i would probably give this video a six and the reason why i'm giving her a six is because the delivery time was great the price was great the music was good so the second person on the fiver gig list is going to be intelligendor i think i said that right if i'm saying it wrong i do apologize and he says on his gig i'll design two best-selling facebook video ads and drop shipping video ad for shopify he's a level one seller and on five you've got different level sellers you've got level one level two and obviously the higher you go the better and he's got a five star review based on 42 orders and he's got two orders in the queue and his standard package says package for one best video ads 30 seconds long and it's going to cost around about 15 dollars one product equals one 30 second video best selling shopify facebook instagram video ads a three-day delivery time the same as the last person five revision which is two more revisions than the previous person video editing script writing 30 seconds running time show product imagery and background music so it's pretty much the same as the last person and if you scroll down and look at the gig it says get a stunning and mouth-watering video ad for only five dollars i'll create a mind-blowing facebook video ad for your products that are optimized for a good ROI, so have success in sales, your business. We, we guarantee that our video ads entice people to click. I specialize in Facebook ads for Shopify dropshipping and I understand Facebook strict guidelines and I know what it takes to make viral converting ad. So the thing that I love about this gig is this guy's saying he knows what the rules are with Facebook and he knows how to always be on point when it comes to their policies. So that's something that I've not read in the other gig. And the thing you would understand is if you're making video ads for people, it's always good that you're always staying up to date with the policies that Instagram and Facebook are doing because if they make a video ad for you and it's against the rules on Facebook, then you've just paid for something that's not gonna work. So I'm glad that he said that because that gives me insurance that he knows what he's doing with the policies and how to stay with them and abide by them. Now, if you take a look at the actual seller's profile, it says he is from Nigeria. He joined in August, 2019. So he's got a lot more experience in terms of the Fiverr platform than the previous person. Average response time is one hour. Last delivery was 14 hours ago. He put, hello, I'm the founder of Intelligent Films. I team up with my hardworking sis, who is also a professional editor 
editor to give my clients a mind-blowing video ad to boost explode sales. I'm a professional video editor with many years experience with Facebook ads, Shopify, eBay, Amazon, and I've been starting engaging optimized for conversion due to quality of content and fantastic service. So let's give this guy a message and see what he says. So I messaged this guy with the same script again and he messaged back saying, hi, thanks for contacting me. Kindly send me the product and let's see if we can figure something out. And then he put his onto it and then put, I want one video ad with Facebook ads, make it a custom offer, please. And then he sent me a custom offer and it equivalated to after I paid all the fees and whatnot to around about $15. Bit of a childish, like the music's a little bit for child, like children, childish. I feel like it's for a baby ad, not a juice ad. So, don't know about the music, guys. That was a bad call to action on my part here, guys. So let's break down that video ad. So the first thing that I'm gonna say is, the shot selection was good. They showed some really good cinematic footage and I was really happy with the actual footage he chose. Again, really happy with it. Some of the footage was a little bit on the low end quality. I'd like to see 1080p, but I know with some products it's hard to find 1080p quality of videos for the ad itself. But I would have liked to see a little bit of better video quality. Also, the music he chose was wrong for the ad. I feel like with an ad like that, you should be picking something with a high tempo, something a little bit more mature. I feel like that music was a lot more for a choice Children's product. I just had that child effect to it and I just didn't like it. Also, the words that he was using, he was using things like make a perfect drink and you gotta remember he's using the wrong word. It shouldn't be drink, it should be smoothie because it's a smoothie product. So I feel like the actual wording he's used could be a little bit better when it comes to naming things like smoothie instead of drink and it just didn't sound too great like that on the ad itself. I'd also say the call to action wasn't great. It was like this glitchy effect with orange writing and I thought like that's good for like a tech product Product, but for a product for a smoothie, it shouldn't have been like that. It should have been something like the other one where it showed the fruit at the back and it just had normal writing with a bit of color to it. But I feel like that call to action just didn't fit the product very well. Something else I wanna say, I didn't really like the colors that he used for the actual text and the overlay colors. Like it's just black and white and he obviously inverted that a couple of times throughout the video. But I would like to see the text overlay and the text itself a little bit more colorful to match the actual ad because it's a very colorful product, very colorful video ad. I would have liked to see it maybe alternate with different Different colors it would have been really nice to see especially with a product like this what i will say on the positive side is the opening scene fit my criteria he showed the product in terms of the hook showing the results straight away and he said do you want a portable blender from home so i really did like that opening scene and again the clips that he used throughout the video was very very good so overall i'd probably give this guy a seven um, and the reason why I'm giving him one point more than the other person was because the text wasn't as long, the text wasn't in terms of grammar, wasn't as bad as the other one, and I feel like the actual clip selection was a lot better on this one as well. So the third person on the Fiverr gig list today is gonna be 8th Studio, and he said, I will create a viral Shopify and Facebook dropshipping video ad, and he's a level two seller, so it's one above the last one and the other two, and he's got 2,186 reviews, and he's got a 4.8 star review based on that and he's got 19 orders in the queue, so I hope that doesn't affect his delivery time. And his gig says, one custom video ad, well, we will create one custom video ad for your dropshipping product, one day delivery time. So he's saying one day delivery time. And this is the first guy to do that. And he's gonna give two revisions, so it's not as good in terms of the revisions. The other guys are offering five and three. He's gonna be doing video editing, but he's not gonna be doing any script writing. He's gonna do a 30 second running time, one length variation, one size orientation, show product imagery and background music. So this is the only guy that didn't include the script writing. So if we take a look at the actual gig itself, he's saying, hi folks, we are here to design Facebook or Instagram dropshipping product or Amazon video ads. Our designers will create clean, impressive and outstanding viral video ads for your dropshipping product. We are good at creating video ads for social media platforms such as Google, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, Snapchat. Delivery time is fantastic. We'll create your video within 24 hours. And then he put, what do I need from you? And then he said, what you'll receive in return. So if we take a look at this guy's actual profile itself, he's from the Ukraine. He's been a member since 2014. So he's been on the Fire platform for a very long time 
time now, average response time one hour ago, last delivery one hour ago. Looking for content creators for your needs, 8th Studio is always open for a corporation, contact us for free estimates. So I'll message the guy with the same script again and he put hi there, thank you for contacting us. My name is Tamara and I'll be more than happy to assist you. So it looks like there's a team of them because she's saying that who she is out of the team. We'll create your video from already existing video footage. On the internet, we'll use royalty free video footage only. So this is the only guy that's actually said they're only gonna use royalty free video. That basically means that you won't get in trouble with copyright. So that's really cool to see that somebody's including that. And then he put, can you please provide me the link to the product so I can basically take a look so i sent him the link and then basically i said can you send me a custom gig and it looked at about 25 dollars after all the fees and if i look at the about section on the right he's actually a top seller as well which is really impressive so let's have a look at what he actually designed for us one day later, they were able to deliver the video ad to me, so they stayed within the one day delivery time, which is amazing. But I hope they didn't rush it for the sake of just one day delivery time. I'd wish, I would rather them take like an extra day if it's gonna be a lot better. But something that these guys did that the others didn't do is, they actually sent us a thumbnail showcasing the actual image itself. So it's great that they're actually sending a thumbnail with it instead of just a video, which is a nice little add-on. So you can see here, they sent the thumbnail, and it says portable blender. It shows the blender with orange juice around it, and then different images of juices and fruit it's a pretty good um, thumbnail I'm not gonna lie I'm not gonna complain because he gave it us for free and he didn't even mention he was gonna do it so I'm, I'm, I'm actually really happy that he did that for us very good music I like the music I like the red transitions it keeps you focused on the video I like the colour psychology, key points in red writing. Yeah, that was nice. That was really, really, that was smooth. I really like that. So if we take a look at the video again, I was really happy with that. So what I'm gonna say is he started off the opening scene with the call to action, the hook saying, want the perfect smoothie, with a very nice, colorful, vibrant image and video of the smoothie at the end. And it says at the top there, pour the blender with two emojis. Now, one thing I might say about that is with the new Facebook rules, you might get in trouble doing that because they don't like more than 20% text on your ads. So that could potentially get your ads in a bit of a situation where they might get a little bit throttled. So that's the only thing I'd complain about so far. I do like the music they've used. It definitely goes really nicely with the video production that they've done. I like the way they've done color psychology, putting words in certain colors to express a certain feeling. And I like the hook that they stuck to. And then when the video goes in, it shows the results of what it'll do and it shows this compared to the normal way. So this shows you what you normally do to get a smoothie, and then they show you what the new way of getting a smoothie is, which is doing these portable blenders. Now, one thing that I don't like about this video is it's too slow. The transitions, the speed ramping's too slow. I just wish they would have done it a little bit faster going into different clips because me watching this now, it does bore me watching these clips for ever so slightly too long. If you got into the clips a lot quicker and aggressive, I think this would have been really, really good. So let's take a look. And again, I really like those red transitions that he does. It keeps you focused on the video if you're gonna like lay out and you're like, mm, I don't wanna watch this anymore. That red like little streak gets you back into the video again. And I really like the call to action. It's very simple and very plain. You've got the swirl transition and then it has like a blurred image in the background of the fruit or the thumbnail they showed us before. And it says order now. Now what I am gonna say is the call to action on the first video is still the best, more colorful, more vibrant, but that's not a bad actual call to action. Now I'm gonna give this video personally an eight and the reason why I'm giving it a mate is because one they've used royalty free video and they've also done a one day delivery time they also gave us a thumbnail as well and the only thing that I really didn't like about this video is I felt like the transitions and the actual speed ramping and jumping into different clips was a bit too slow the actual words they've used were really good um, in terms of describing what's happening in the video I didn't like the emoji at the top I feel like that could have been cut out because that can get you into maybe a few problems here and there with Facebook and Instagram but apart from that I think it's a solid eight that they've done for us right there so the fourth person on the Fiverr gig list is Ecom J, level two seller, and he's got 4.9 stars out of 249 reviews, and he's got 33 orders in queue. Let's hope this doesn't hurt the delivery times. And his gig says, I'll create a viral Shopify and Facebook dropshipping video ad. And his actual gig here, the basic package says, custom video ad basic, amazing 30 to 45 second video ad, HD quality, free translations, ultimate revisions, and get sales now. Three day delivery 
time unlimited revisions unlimited revisions you can't beat that if anything isn't to your liking you can get it changed as many times as you want you can't you really can't beat that then it says video editing script writing show product imagery background music and the only thing he doesn't include is a voiceover now voiceover would have been pretty cool but i'm not too bothered about it personally and if we read the gig it says here the most creative and engaging ads you can find shopify video ad and dropshipping video ad hello if you're looking for a great dropshipping video ad for your facebook to make more sales more views more likes than you have in the right place me and my team and colleagues have set up a successful high profitable ads for ourselves and our clients we do this by following a blueprint of ad success which has worked for us for years so get winning viral ads we'll need a product link and your logo and then it goes over what you need to do to get it and it goes over the scroll stopper and the other stuff that he's going to add in the video like royalty free music and whatnot so let's read this guy's profile his name is ecom j he's from the united kingdom so he's from where i'm from which is also really great he's been a member since april 2020 so to join actually in the year mid-year and all really become a level two seller with lots of reviews if you compare it with the other person at the start the first ever person you gotta remember she joined in january which is longer than this guy she's still a level one seller and she's got nowhere near as many reviews as this guy so i give him a massive shout out for that and he's got here i've been working in e-commerce and dropship for over six years i know what it takes to create a successful and profitable business and i've helped hundreds of clients achieve their dreams it is a passion of mine to do the same for my clients then he says if you're serious in growing your business give me a contact so i contacted ecom j and i sent him the same script and he put hey yes send me the link and i'll see what i can do for you then i sent him the link and he said yeah that's fine i can make an ad for you it's going to take currently two to three days to get it to you and then i asked him do you offer any discounts because guys remember this is a 35 dollar uh, gig so we're starting to get into the expensive range here and he said he didn't offer any um discounts i said that's cool dude just send me your uh, your custom gig and i'll get it paid and again i respect these guys time so i'm happy to pay them so let's check out what ecom j did for us so guys three days later ecom j delivered the video ad to us and he didn't just deliver a video ad to us he delivered three video ads to us and a thumbnail which is amazing so the thumbnail on the screen is what he made for us and this is way better than the other thumbnail the other guys did for us because it's way more colorful it just booms a lot more out of the screen so if i compare them side by side you can see which one's better definitely this one right here and he also sent us three videos which gives us variation which i absolutely love a lot Good music, fast transitions, a lot of speed ramping. I'm really liking this so far. Really cool text as well. Ooh, clean shots. Ooh. That's good. Oh, damn, that speed ramping's good. Yeah, clean call to action as well. Damn, this guy does it all. So, really impressed with that, guys. The music was amazing. It's unique music. Never really heard it on an ad before. I also like the speed ramp, and that's what I was talking about before. Really aggressively showing the actual scene and then getting to the next scene and going from it. And I also like the text he's used. I also like the video footage. It's also a lot more better quality in terms of resolution than the others. And he did a really nice, cool, clean call to action like that. And it just, it just fits the mood. He stuck with a green color skin and it just really nicely fitted with the video so if i reverse this back to the start it shows this getting uh, this kiwi getting uh, drilled and you can see it's really nice and again that music with the speed ramping then those fruits being flowing out of the air and then it shows this woman that's obviously come back from the gym or going to the gym and it shows different scenarios and i just like the music and again it just shows these results it shows how the product works really fast and yeah overall really impressed i was impressed that he delivered three videos now i'm not going to show you all videos but the other two videos the only difference was like the first five seconds i wish he changed the music in every other video that he made the music and the colors but to just give me three videos in general anyway i'm really happy with that so i'm going to give ecom j a nine out of ten that was solid a nine out of ten really impressive with ecom j so guys the fifth fiverr gig is by a guy called shaddy and he's a level two seller and he's got five star reviews based on 302 people and he's got six orders in queue and his gig says i'll create dropshipping video ads and facebook ads and his basic package is a video and a thumbnail a viral video ad with a free eye-catching thumbnail three days 
piece of delivery time unlimited revisions absolutely love video unlimited revisions video editing script writing 40 seconds running time one length variation one size orientation show product imagery and background music and this guy is the most expensive one today so i'm expecting some really big things from him and his gig says dropshipping video ads are the key to dropshipping business success do you have a dropshipping shopify or woocommerce business if you have then you realize that the promote the products drive traffic to your store without a good dropshipping video ad is the death of dropshipping businesses i will create winning dropshipping facebook ads for your products and then he says please no i don't provide filming recording services or voiceovers that's not including in my gigs and then if we look at the actual profile of this guy he's basically been on fiverr from june 2019 he's from tunisia he's got an average response time of one hour and his last delivery was 17 minutes ago so let's take a look at some of the examples that he's got on his actual fiverr because this guy is definitely very expensive so this video ad here looks pretty basic oh those transitions to the noises are pretty cool okay not too bad not too bad the colors are pretty cool yeah that's not too bad let's have a look at some of the other ones he's got because i'm not gonna lie guys like almost 50 dollars for an ad i'm expecting some big things So guys, after looking at Shady's portfolio on his Fiverr page, it's pretty cool. He's using sound effects that the other guys haven't used and he's using some transitions that the other guys didn't use. So let's hope that for almost $50, this guy is gonna be really, really good. So I messaged this guy on Fiverr with the same script again. And he said, hello, thanks for choosing our service. We know exactly what works and send us your product from AliExpress and we'll look at the videos online for you. And then I sent him the videos and he put sure I can work on this product. He said two, three delivery time for this. And he said, honestly, I'm looking at $40 as your low now after i paid all the fees and stuff it came to around about 45 dollars so after one day he delivered the video ad and the actual thumbnail which is really good it's a lot faster than he had advertised on his page which was two to three days and this is the thumbnail that he sent me and the thumbnail is actually pretty cool i like the way he's used some animation uh, pictures there and whatnot but i still think the thumbnail from ecom j is better than this one but i appreciate it i'd probably rank this thumbnail second out of the three that we've seen in today's video The music's not good, I don't like the music at all. The colours are pretty cool, the clips are a bit slow. The wording's actually really good itself. The transitions are pretty cool and catchy. Definitely not the music though, the music's not very good. Oh, the call to action's pretty bad as well. Oh, guys, for $45, I don't know, I don't know. I'm a bit worried actually for the $45 that we just spent on that. So what I will say is, the clips he's used are, are pretty good. They're nowhere near as good as Ecom J's, um, but the video clips were pretty good. Now, the only thing that I didn't like a lot was the music. I feel like the music was just a music that you've heard in loads of different video ads, and I just really did not like the music in that ad at all. I just feel like it didn't fit it, and I feel like it was a bad choice. I also feel like the actual time and the wavelength of the actual ad itself was very slow, and I feel like it could have been spent up, and I feel like he used those aggressive transitions to make it feel like it was speeded up, but it wasn't. So I like the transitions and the sound effects. I feel like that gets your attention, but I just feel like the clips are just too slow and compared to Ecom J's where it's speed ramped, it's just nowhere near as good. I do like the actual um, wording he's used, the copywriting he's used. So if you look at some of the wording he's used throughout the ad, it's actually really good. It's not long compared to the first couple of ads we saw. The actual words they've used were way too long. It's like a sentence of words. These are just short words and it gets you across the video really nicely. You can look at the words, read it and watch the video at the same time with the other ones. You couldn't really do that apart from this one in Ecom J's because the word was just too long, the sentences were too long, you couldn't read it and watch the clip. So I respect that. I like the way he's used green to match the color of the blender. I appreciate that. And I feel like the call to action wasn't very well done. I feel like with the call to action, I wish he just used those clips normally with a bit of music over it, with just no wording over it at all, and then done a powerful call to action at the end like the other guys did. So this is the only guy that did like a video with an overlay call to action, which I don't really like, especially with the way he's done it here. Um, and again, for $45, guys, I'd probably give this guy a seven. So I'm gonna give this guy a seven. And the reason why I'm giving him a seven is because number one, he charged $45, which is a lot of money for a video ad. 
I felt like the music wasn't good and I feel like the actual clips themselves could have been a lot more fun. Um, so I feel like it's fair just to give them a 7 out of 10. Let me know in the description what you guys would have given each one of these guys on Fiverr in terms of the ratings. Do you agree with my ratings? Would you change them? But I'm happy to give him just a 7 for this, guys. So, guys, let me showcase the results for this Fiverr Shopify dropshipping video ad challenge. And I'm going to be ranking them from 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 in terms of positions. 5th being the worst and number 1 obviously being the best. Now, when I showcase the results with you, this doesn't mean that who came 5th is really bad and they shouldn't do what they do. I believe everybody that I paid for during these gigs are very good at what they do and they've got a lot of potential going forward I feel like some people just had a bad day Some people may have rushed their video ad or some people maybe just didn't do it to their best Capabilities, so I believe that everybody today that I chose are very good at what they do But some did better than the others and that's just my honest opinion So guys, let me know in the description as well when I do the rankings who you would have picked to come first second third fourth and fifth If you don't agree with what I've done today So who came fifth would have been the five dollar video ad the person that came for would have been the $45 video ad who came third would have been the $15 video ad who came second would have been the $28 video ad and who came first would have been the $35 video ad which was the ecom j guy so those were my rankings in terms of first to fifth in terms of positioning let me know if you agree or let me know in the comment section who you would have placed where and for what reasons so guys that wraps up this challenge today let me know if you enjoyed it in the comment section and make sure you smash the like button so you can end Enter the giveaway and also leave a comment so you can enter the giveaway to win these video ads that I showcased in this video and I'll catch you guys on the next one.